Hi, it's Paul Maunder from Production Expert. In this video, I'll be using Krotos Studio to create sound for video. Firstly, I'll be making something to go with an animated logo, and after that, we'll take a look at adding environmental sounds to a couple of scenes using the multi out feature in Krotos Studio. So, to get started, let's have a look at the logo animation. I'd like to use sounds which Krotos added in the recent update. Auditioning a couple of them, we have Wind Wash, or maybe this one will work better, Savage Blitz. I'll try a variation on that. Yep, yeah, that's good. We'll give it a go, so I'll take it back to the start, play it. That works really well actually, so now I can drag this onto a track and take a listen to it with the video. Nice, okay. Now we need to add a short wash at the end there. We could try another one of the new sounds, Electromorph. Let's try changing the sound. And again. Yeah, I like that. Now I'll just perform the movement quickly. Drag that in and get it in about the right place. And of course, if I wanted to, I could go in and edit it. Great, okay, let's take a look at something else. In this session, we have two shots, both filmed in London. The first is this shot of people walking around in Covent Garden. And following that, it cuts to a shot of St. James's Park, which of course is still in the city, but there would be more nature sounds, birds and so on. Conveniently, Krotos added this London downtown preset. We can preview it and take a listen. Within the preset, we can choose between Waller, so people talking and so on. Or we could have more steps and bicycles. We'll need footsteps, but not really bikes for this shot. Or we could shift it over to urban nature. That might be better for the second shot and we can adjust the blend between traffic or we could push it over to bed. So actually to demonstrate another feature I'm going to keep this right in the middle because I'd like to use the multi out feature. I've created four stereo audio tracks and you can see if I go to the track input selector that we have the option of assigning the inputs to the four core engines in Krotos Studio. Now if I record enable the tracks and start it running it generates a continuous background ambience, which can actually be any length, but in this case, I only really need it to cover the few second duration of this shot. I'll keep it going until we get to the end and just let it run slightly beyond so I can create crossfades later. That'll do. Let's take a listen to the recordings from the different engines. First one. Second. And the third. That's probably the one I'm interested in boosting in level, actually. I think that might be a better balance. I'll turn this one down. Okay, I'm happy with that. I'll trim these clips at the edit point for now by putting the selector in them and then pressing S. So now I need to create this sound for St. James's Park. So before I do this, let's just try and change the sound a bit and tweak it for what we need. So maybe if I just start this running and then shift it over to Urban Nature. That's quite good, but I might want to adjust between bed and traffic. So I think I'm just going to shift it slightly more towards traffic. Okay. Yeah, that sounds about right. And now I'm happy with it, so I'll start the recording going. And I want this just to run slightly longer than I really need it. Because I want the ability to fade it, crossfade it and so on. Okay, that's enough. And then, just to finish it off, I'll go in and just trim these clips. And then just for simplicity, I'm actually going to group these tracks. And then maybe shift these back. Apply a bit of a crossfade. And then take this back and let's take a listen. Sounds good. And of course I could go in, tweak those levels, maybe reduce the sound of those bicycles again and really tailor the sound exactly as I needed it. We've only really begun to scratch the surface in this video of what Krotos Studio is capable of. If you need soundscapes which evolve and change over time, or perhaps you need to create sound for a cinematic trailer using some of the sounds you can hear running in the background now, Krotos Studio is an easy to use tool which allows you to get to a very good result extremely quickly. 
We'll be covering more about Krotos Studio soon, so keep an eye on the Production Expert blog for that, or head over to krotosaudio.com to learn more. Thanks for watching.